guys, it's your girl Quinn B and I am back with another video. In today's video, I will be doing a DIY designer inspired phone case for you guys using my Cricut machine. But before we hop right into the video, you guys know the drill. Do not forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Tap the notification bell right beside it so you can get new alerts when I post new content. So let's hop right into it. Okay. Also, be sure to stick around to the end of the video so you guys can see which small business I will be highlighting next. Let's go. So, these are the things that we are going to need to do this cute little DIY. Um, I've been using my Cricut machine for about a couple weeks now and I freaking love it. It is the best. It is really good for um, birthdays, events, holidays, anything that you may um, need to personalize uh, or use for personalized gifts. It is uh, great for that. So I decided to make this cute little clear designer inspired phone case. I'm going to make a white one as I've already, I have already have a pink one and as you guys can see it is for my phone. Um, I will not be using this for any resale purposes. This is strictly for my phone. So hopefully it will zoom in so you, can, you guys can see. There it is. Ooh, yes. I freaking love it. So we're going to make a white one today. Um, before I go into the process of how I created that one because I'm pretty much going to just be showing the process. I won't be talking as, as much anymore because it's kind of self-explanatory as you guys watch me do it. I don't really need to explain it. So that's how that's going to go. But um, I do want to say this before I go ahead and show the process is that I love the fact that I decided to come up with the clever idea to put the design inside the phone case. So I've seen some videos where they do um, DIY phone cases and they put it on the outside but I got this cool little trick to put the design on the inside and all you have to do is mirror the image um, and put the design on the inside. It protects the design um, opposed to if it was on the outside. It prote protects the design from wear and tear and you can't even feel it. It's like embedded into the phone case which is perfect. Um, your phone is actually protecting design and the case is protecting your phone. So put the phone, the design on the inside and just mirror the image and you'll be fine. Um, I did test out because I've done this a couple times um, using other designs. Um, so I did test it out to see what it would look like um, trying to put clear coat over the design because I did at first put the design on the outside and I used Mod Podge and I don't like how it turned out. I don't know if you guys can see but it left a smear like it's, it's very smeared and you really can see it against the, let me see, you really can see it against the phone these streak lines and I don't like it. Um, I tried it on the outside of the phone and I also tried it on the inside of the phone and it didn't turn out too well. So to seal it, you don't need to seal it. It's permanent vinyl. You will be fine as long as you put the design on the inside. Um, now if you put it on the outside, I don't know what to tell you. Oh, also this does not work on silicone cases. This just works on the uh, the other ones. So can't use the silicone because the vinyl will not stick to it and be sure to put your design on the inside of the clear case and mirror the image. For this project I will be using permanent vinyl, transfer tape, rubbing alcohol, paper towel to wipe off the rubbing alcohol, a phone case, a laptop or a phone to connect to your vinyl cutter, a vinyl cutter, um, and the tools that come with a vinyl cutter or that you use when you are cutting out stuff using your vinyl cutter. I will be using my weeding tool and my X-Acto knife. I've been using my Cricut machine for a couple weeks now and I freaking love it. I really love it. I'm starting to learn more and more. I YouTube videos um, about how to use it all the time. So if you guys have any questions, just Google it or YouTube it because the answer is probably there. Um, 
yeah so let's get into the video now going to customize this just to make sure the size is right so right now right now we're in Cricut design space and I've already uploaded the image I already have a transparent design um, you can go to Google and find an image and take out the white background sometimes that doesn't come out clear for the image itself and the, and the design or you can purchase a stencil um, I'm sure you can get one from Etsy of the design as well and then just crop out the part that you need to so I'm just going to make sure this is the, the correct size and I do need this about three inches five and a half and that looks about right I believe it's three inches six so we'll go with that right around there and I'm going to just make it select mirror move this over a little bit perfect and hit continue and we're gonna go you also can purchase oh we're gonna select vinyl you also can purchase a phone case especially a clear phone case from pretty much anywhere I purchased mine from five and below you guys can purchase it from Walmart or wherever
I hope you enjoyed the video thank you for watching be sure to check out my next one as I am only getting better if you like this crop top hoodie that I'm wearing here and here make sure you check it out at blacklashbrand.com where you can shop on my website and you may find some other things you like there as well so I'm gonna head out but I hope you guys stick around to check out this small business